our ambassador finally found you. Took a damn time. But you're here now, and that's what counts. Welcome to Orsinium. Amazing how fast we rebuilt the place, isn't it? Awesomer can do anything when we work together. That's good. That's good. But anyways, I found out uh, where the Winterborn uh, took the stolen supplies. The damn Reachmen and their foul magic. It provides the Winterborn with an unlimited number of soldiers to send against us. Even so, our soldiers have dispatched all but one of their warlords. That bastard, Yorfon Iceheart. Where are the supplies? Really quick. Is the Reachmen Bretons? Or ancestors? Or... I, I think lore-wise they are somehow related to Bretons. Let me know down in the comments section if you guys know a little bit of the lore uh, involving the Reach, uh, the Reachmen. But anyways, the uh, they were taken to F Frostbreak Fortress. I heard Iceheart himself guards them. Trinimax smiles upon us then. My son, King Kurog, has already traveled to Frostbreak Fortress to deal with Warlord Iceheart directly. Without a strong leader, the Winterborn threat will fade away. You must go and tell the king about the supplies. Yeah, for sure. I'll go tell the king right away. There are two things my son can't resist. Food and battle. When he learned of Iceheart's location, he rushed to deal with the warlord personally. Help him end the threat and recover the supplies. The unification of the orc clans depends on it. If you guys already knew where they were, why did you need me to tell you? I don't know. I find that kind of weird. But how will this keep, uh, help King Kurog unite the or or Orc clans? The Winterborn pose a threat to all of Rothgar. Jorvan Iceheart in particular has long been a thorn in our side. The King issued the order to invite you to our land. If the Winterborn are defeated thanks to that order, the clans will take notice. Doesn't... Doesn't the king have an army? Of course. But many of our best warriors are off helping the Alliance. <laughs> Besides, the other clan chiefs are too busy seeking their own glory. My son needs someone at his side who has nothing to prove. Someone without an axe to grind. Someone you someone like you okay anyways it's kind of sad that they're sending troops to help you know daggerfall covenant uh they're sending the troops to help you know the daggerfall covenant fight the the, the three banners war i believe is what it's called and yet they're suffering militarily here in their own homeland it's kind of weird well what can you tell me about the winterborn the accursed Winterborn of the Reach. Under the Longhouse Emperors, they dominated these mountains. But the mountains belong to us now. We've driven the cowards back, but their leader, Jorfon Iceheart, still lives. It's time to change that. I guess I'm going to kill Jorfon Iceheart. Where'd I meet King Kurog? You can find my son at the camp outside Frostbreak Fortress. It's an old Breton fort southwest of Orsinium. We've been laying siege to the place for weeks, but Iceheart and his rats have burrowed deep. Go and help my son exterminate the vermin. I think this right here kind of answered my question that I that I asked a little bit ago. But it, still, regardless, let me know down in the comment section if you guys know. Because it's, it's kind of like indirect. I'm not 100% sure. It's just kind of assumed that they're Bretons at this point. Um, why does the king have you making these arrangements? This is Orsinium. Don't you know our traditions? No. Kurog is king, the chief of our clan, and every clan far and wide. When it comes to war, he's in command. Everything else is better left to the capable skills of his mother and wives. Okay. I respect your traditions. It's a little strange. You don't always have to lead from the front, you know? Sometimes if you take a step back, you can see the battlefield as a whole. So, 
Although I respect his bravery and his courage, sometimes it is better to take a step back, you know? But, whatever, there's different tactics, different situations, so... Who am I to speak on that? King Karag is married? Oh yes, and many times over, just like any other clan chief. Noroga the Huntwife, Tuga the Forge Wife, Barisal the Hearthwife, and he has a few Shield Wives as well. They're all fine young women. Kurog's been well matched. I've seen to that. He has a lot of wives. <laughs> Tell me about the High Priestess, uh, Solgra. High Priestess <clears throat> Solgra? Oh, we couldn't have done any of this without her. She upholds the ancient traditions, traditions we sorely need right now. With her help, we will restore the true religion of the Awesomer, the religion of Trinamac. What is Trinamac? Trinamac the warrior, the paragon. Once he was our patron, our god. He encompasses the true ideals of the Awesomer. Strength, honor, and unity. Talk to High Priestess Solgra. She speaks of Trinamac with more elegance and passion than I can manage. Okay, fair enough. Solgra, that's not... Yeah, it is her. So speak to her. I do not wish to delay your journey. I have duties to attend to at the temple, and I know King Korag awaits you at Frostbreak Fortress. Still, in all my travels, I've never encountered so many troublesome extremists as I have here in Orsinium. I really am digging the way she looks. She looks pretty dope. Uh, tell me a little bit about yourself. I studied at the Mages Guild in Wayrest for many years before traveling across southern Tamriel. I eventually wound up in the Somerset Isles. That was where I first heard the words of Trinamac and found my true calling. Your true calling? I have been called to restore the Awesomer to our true destiny. To revive the ancient traditions. The ideals of truth, honor, and unity. This is Trinamac's will and desire. I have my part to play, and you have yours. I mean, that's fair, but... I always thought that the orcs worshipped Malakath. Yes, my people are stubborn. They see Malakath as our protector, but nothing could be further from the truth. Malakath's passion is vengeance. We cast ourselves as victims, and this holds us back. Trinamac's light, however, can restore our glory. Moral of the story is, stop victimizing yourself. <laughs> you mentioned trouble uh, with extremists? Followers of both Malakath and Trinamac can be prone to violence. Forge Mother Alga helps keep things civil, though I fear things will get worse before they get better. The fanatics on both sides act out of ignorance, I believe, not out of ill will. Okay. Where does the Forge Mother fall on the matter? She sees the path that Trinamac has set before us. Half the wives in every clan owe her favors, and it was her influence that allowed the city temple to be dedicated to Trinamac. And King Kurub agrees with all this? The king was skeptical at first, but he and a few clan chiefs eventually embraced the will of Trinamac. Most of the other chiefs remain opposed to such drastic change, however. They hold on to the old superstitions and refuse to hear the truth. Good to know. Well, wow, this is interesting. There's a lot of really good lore in this, uh, in this DLC so far. Hold on real quick. So we're going outside of the city. How far are we going? We're going far far I'm gonna take this way shrine to this one it'll save me like a, a minute or two and then we're gonna huff it all the way over there that's far though hold on wait where's the uh oh I gotta stop running off things don't I like that luckily this one's just literally right here let me get on my my pony the trail my super slow pony. Can I get that from here? Uh, yes. Yes, I can. Alright. We are mostly there. And at the same time, excruciatingly far. Oh my god, dude. We're gonna die. Bastion, I need your help there, buddy. Oh, God. No remorse. 
What's up, bro? Bastion, stop doing that. You scare me every time you do that. He, like, curls up like he's taking a dump and then he just blows up from his backside. Maybe he is. Good job. Is it is it in here? You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna discover this since it's literally right here. These aren't bad, are they? They're not. They're kind of cute, actually. They're like tiny little mammoths. I I want to say well, it kind of feels like it's inside that little fortress or that stronghold, but at the same time, it's it doesn't. Oh God, who's fighting? Bastion, why are you starting stuff? Bastion, Bastion, Bastion. Always literally starting drama. It can't possibly be that far. It's still a little far. I'm gonna take my horse because... Wait, hold on. Do I have... I don't have continuous attack. Wait. Okay. Yeah, let's... This makes me a little bit faster. It's absolutely essential. It's like a little cheaty way of actually getting a little bit of speed. So I was wrong. It wasn't in that fortress back there. But it is in a fortress, apparently. And we got another um, way shrine to discover. This, this landscape is actually kind of beautiful, low-key. Alright, we are here. So I'm pretty sure this is gonna continue off of this, so let's go ahead and do this first. I want all the soldiers from all of the clans to circle the fort. I start to escape from me this time. Our soldiers know what to do, Kirok. You can count on that. Then maybe this victory will finally convince you and the other chiefs to fully accept my claim to the throne. Okay. King Karag. You always just barge into the king's tent without so much as a by your leave? Yes. Who in the name of First Forge do you think you are, troll breath? I'm AG. Your mother sent me, by the way, uh, to help you. He looks absolutely awesome. He looks insane. That looks dope. So, you're one of the outsiders my mother's been harping about. Uh-huh. I'm Kurok, King of the Orsimer. Welcome to my war. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Your timing's perfect. I'm just finishing this damn fine wag of chumloon. You hungry? I do enjoy a good meal before a fight. <laughs> uh, no thank you. I have news though. The stolen su uh, supplies are actually inside of that fortress. It's a good thing that that's where we're going then. This siege was taking too long anyway. Your fawn Iceheart is the last of the Winterborn Warlords. And frankly, I'm ready to be done with him. He, he knows we're coming, so I'm expecting a good fight. <laughs> you told him we're coming? You bet your arse I told him <laughs> we were coming. Fair's fair. They probably scared the ice water out of his veins. <laughs> I want to see you in action. You lead, I'll follow. Now, let's go kill old Iceheart. Then we can return to Orsidium and feast. <laughs> so much for the element of surprise, but hey, whatever, man, that works for me. Let's go. Is the king really going to come with us? Oh, that's dope. To get to Iceheart. Talk to the siege commanders and see if they can get us inside. I'm assuming this is one of the siege I've commanders. Got a lot to do here. Now that's a suck. Look at those catapults fly. I'm amazed the towers can withstand the punishment. The Bretons must have used war crafters, and they built that place to last. But never fear, the Winterborn the won't have a fort to protect them for much longer. What's going on here? Kirog summoned the chiefs of Rothgar to besiege the Winterborn. One of our biggest problems are those Briar Heart monstrosities. For every one we kill, two more take its place. I know there's a solution, but damn if it doesn't keep eluding us. So what's your plan? We need to get inside the fort. <laughs> Find out where they're spawning those abominations. 
but the damn harpies. We can't walk five steps without becoming bird food. Siege Commander Dope's working on a plan. I hope it's a good one, for all our sakes. Yeah, for sure, I'll talk to Siege Commander... ...him, and see if I can help. This is the Winterborn's final stand. We destroy the Briar Hearts while Chiron deals with their warlord, Iceheart. If we succeed, Chiron will have ended a threat that has plagued us for far too long. Maybe then I'll consider accepting him as our king. So the Harpies and Winterborn are working together? Surprising, isn't it? A little bit. We're pretty sure they're all connected to the Hag Ravens, or whatever you call those ugly old hags. It wouldn't surprise me if the Briar Hearts are also their creation. They're all vile, a lot of them. What can you tell me about the Briar Hearts? The Briar Heart warriors are like the undead, only worse. They talk to each other, think on their own, behave just like any other soldier. But there's no way they're alive. Not with half their chest hanging wide open. That is strange. They were in Skyrim too. So I know all about them. Uh, their chest hang open? I guess you haven't experienced a Winterborn raid yet. You can actually see their foul hearts beating inside their open chests. Except they aren't hearts at all. More like some sort of malignant growth. Gross. It's unsettling to see, to say the least. Is there a problem between the Chiefs and King Korog? You can say that. It started when he claimed the title of king. Many chiefs aren't ready to bend their knee to Kirog. It's not the orc way. But Kirog knows how to conduct a battle. Look around. No clan could muster a force such as this. But you're working with him now. Kirog believes that the orcs need a united kingdom. We banded together to defend our land. But beyond that, we'll see. The Winterborn have been ransacking Hrothgar for years. At least Kirog has brought us together to try to put an end to that. You know, what would make more sense than a kingdom in this situation? Some sort of a council between, you know, clans. Like where the leaders get together and discuss what happens. And with somebody obviously taking spear, like spearheading the, the meeting, if you will. But he wouldn't be called king. He would be like an overseer or something. But uh, someone who holds the peace between the conversations of between clans, you know? I don't know. That's my opinion. Let me know what you guys think down in the comment section. Unification sounds like a lofty goal. Perhaps. But tradition sometimes is too high a wall to climb up. We're a proud and stubborn people. New ideas, they frighten us. And Kirov is full of new ideas. A new city, a new god. It's more than many of us can take. But if he wins the day... Yeah, I mean, I get it. I get it. So then we if have... If we don't find the alchemist and destroy those nests, we'll never break this siege. You heard him. This is the siege the commander. King. That's it? You just have three people? Get down! Oh, they're gonna die. No! no. no. Damn it! Looks like General more Ghost soldiers could that use way. a hand. Well, they're definitely dead. Hey, Siege Commander. You, you brought the king here? Then welcome to our siege camp. Sorry you had to see those damn harpies at work. I'm not sure King Korok should be walking around out in the open, but I've got a barrel full of my own worries to deal with. How can I help? If you want to become bird food, I'm not going to stop you. And after losing more soldiers to the harpies, I'm ready to accept any help I can get. Besides, anything is better than what the little wood elf was able to accomplish. The little wood elf? Evely, no. It's, uh, he's talking crap about you. Sent her in with a squad of orcs to deal with the harpy nests on the towers. Figured if the nests were on fire, the distraction would allow another squad to get in and put an end to the briar hearts. But both groups have disappeared without a trace. <gasps> I can try to find your missing squads. A volunteer. <clears throat> I appreciate that kind of go get em attitude. If you do manage to find either of the missing squads, remind them that they have their orders. I expect them to complete their missions. The outcome of this siege depends on them. Uh, how do you re how do you recommend I approach the fortress? The main path is too well defended. You'll be a lamb led to the slaughter if you go that way. 
Our siege provides some cover, so you might be able to sneak around the left side of the fort. And the right side is clear, except for the harpies. Hmm. The right side is clear, except for the harpies. So the harpies seems to be a little bit less confrontation. The other way, the left side is more actual battle. Uh, tell me about the two squads you sent inside. <clears throat> I sent the wood elf and one squad to set fire to the harpy nests. The other squad is supposed to find the source of the briar hearts and put an end to that threat. But everything hinged on dealing with the harpies. We just can't get past the birds. How are they supposed to set fire to the nest at the top of the towers? My siege engineers can easily calibrate the trebuchets to launch direct strikes against the airy towers. They just need something to target. That's the first squad's mission. Mark the airy so we can knock it out of the sky. So they but... So then the left side is more important. I mean, they're both... I don't know. What can you tell me about the Briarheart Warriors? The Winterborn Zombies? Not much. Our alchemist, Alinan, has some experience dealing with the Reach. He thinks the Hag Ravens grow the hearts, planting them and harvesting them like grapes from a vine. A disgusting image, I know, but that's Alinan. They grow hearts? That's what Alinan thinks. As long as he can put a stop to the foul things, I don't care how crazy his ideas sound. But he's with the second squad, somewhere on the other side of those walls. Without Alinan, things get much more complicated. Good to know. So we have two directions we gotta go then, right? Let me see the map. So there's... Find a way inside the fortress. Let's... Let's find... Let's do this first. Let's earn the king some respect. Hey, it's Evely. Oh, no, it's not. It's... A another player. Hello. Goodbye. You. Huzzah. Huzzah. Or whatever. Okay, so I definitely can't go this way. So I gotta find a way to get up there. I guess there is only one way to go. The harpy direction. Oh, it's, it's a bunch of squads. They're still coming. Good. Bastion, go help. Nice helping. I still need to buy all my glyphs for my armor, I think. Hello. Done so. Get out of here, you stupid birds. But now, what's, uh... Isn't that the... I thought that was the quest I had on. Sit your butt down. Where'd he go? Oh, snap. I like this build so much better than what I had before. Not not that the last build was bad, it's just this is just so much better, you know? Did I miss? I think I missed. Haha! -ha. Oh the first squad's in here. I got no stamina either. Stop. 
Are you good? Soldiers, lower your weapons. Looks like reinforcements have arrived. I mean, kind of. It's just... It's just me, the king, and Bastion. You and the king have come to our aid? We're honored. But we've been trapped in here for too long. We still have a mission to complete. His helmet looks sick. How did you wind up trapped in here? Once again, we underestimated the Winterborn's capabilities. They caught scent of us as soon as we penetrated the walls. Harpies from above, Winterborn from all sides. We lost a lot of soldiers before we were able to take refuge in this tower. What was your squad's mission? We need to get our archer into position to mark the Harpy Iries so that our catapults can target them and destroy them. We lost all of our archers. The Wood Elf's all we have left. I hope she's as good of a shot as she claims to be. I'm 100% certain she is. Any idea where the second squad may be? Our squad split off right after we entered the fortress. They're protecting the Breton alchemist who's supposed to be able to put an end to the Briarheart threat. But it doesn't matter if they're dead or alive if we don't deal with the harpies. How can I help? If you can clear us a path to the towers, we can get the elf into position so she can loose her signal arrows. Then the catapults can do their work. We need to hurry. We've lost too much time already. Too easy. Back outside then? Come on, Bastion. We got business to take care of. Oh, you want to fight? You guys want to fight too? Glad. You're not going to shoot me there, buddy. Nice try. Not going nowhere. Dude, yeah, this build is so much better. I... I having, you know... Resource issues still, but... Not as bad as I used to. So this has to be number one. Wait, what's that? Oh, that's for a diff that's for an achievement or something. For the museum, I believe. Do I have to go all the way to the top? Keep up, Elf! Those harpies aren't going to kill but themselves. There are so hey. many stairs. No time for complaints either. We have a mission to complete. All right, all right, pushy orc. Just <laughs> tell me when you want me to make the strike. Hey, Emily. Gusting winds, flying birds trying to eat us, fire everywhere. But that up there, that's a stationary target that needs an arrow in it. Just tell me when you want me to make the strike. Let your arrows loose. Not bad. Oh, snap. That was dope. So we're done here? Look at it burn. I guess so. I just 360 no scope this. Oh, hello. Nice try there, buddy. I That's think the last of them. I think I want like a weapon ability on my front bar. Either that or I need some insane magic. Recovery at minimum. Oh, I didn't even see you. Sit your butt down. Here, I'm gonna search. That's over with, I suppose. These hag ravens really are disgusting, aren't they? So this is it? Can I not go in there? Oh, I have something else to do over here. So in the meantime, Stabby, sit your butt back down. I like it. I think... Since I don't have any actual or, uh, weapon abilities on my back bar. Oh wait, on my 
back bar. I'm actually... I think it would look dope if I had a restoration staff in the back bar. They will be ours. That way, it, at least it kind of like fits the colors. Oh, this is the other... Sit down. I love that ability, dude. It literally made, like, they don't have a choice. They just sit down. Obviously, some of the harder, like, like bosses and stuff like that, uh, they don't get, they don't get effect, affected like that, but still. Power secure. Good work, outsider. Where's Evelyn? The wood elf is right behind me. I don't see her. I'm getting really tired of you orcs trying to leave me be. That's strange. Where did the sergeant go? Now I know why Orsinium put out that call for help. Well, at least you're still here. Let me know when you want me to light the signal. I want you Do to light the signal. Do me a favor and don't let any of those filthy harpies get too close. I'd hate to get carried off because I was busy concentrating on making this ridiculously easy strike. Speaking of which, let me know when you want me to loose my arrow. Yeah, loose your arrow. Two arrows destroyed, no problem. Now, let's find the Breton Alchemist. Boom. Dude, that's so cool, man. Come on, King. Evely, you are an absolute G, you know that? Of course you do, you're Evely. And your arrow is very sharp. The Winterborn know how to set up a defense. Oblivion, yeah. take you. Sit your butt down. I love Templars. I really do. It's a buff, so I gotta go all the way around, don't I? Leave Bastion alone. That's true. Bastion, you're an inspiration to us all. Dunzo. Is that it? What's over here? This is where I jumped down over here, but oh! On the count of three, I'll just run and not look back. Wait, who's who's there? Were you well, always this back is here? Where the little alchemist has been hiding. I recognize that orc standing <clears throat> beside you. That's King Kurog. I'm honored that you and the king came to find me. I just wish you had gotten here sooner, before the rest of my squad was lost. What happened to your squad? Well, we were supposed to wait until the nests were destroyed before heading inside to find the source of the Briarhearts. But? But the Winterborn, they found us, overwhelmed the soldiers. I ran. I'm not proud of it, but I'm alive. That's what matters. You know what they say, you live to fight another day. What's your mission exactly, anyways? Someone has to destroy the source of the Briar Hearts, and I've dealt with the Reach before. They're a rather unhealthy obsession of mine. I know their beliefs, the way they attune with nature. Those Briar Hearts, they're as natural as you and I. Okay. Uh, how can those monsters be natural? I have an inkling, but I need to get inside to confirm it. I need to see how they're applying their magic. That will lead me right to the source of the Briar Hearts. But you'll need to keep me alive. A lot of people are counting on me to succeed. Well then, are we ready? <clears throat> There's nothing else we can do out here. Let's get inside. Deal. How did you get, uh, selected for this mission anyways? <clears throat> I was the only alchemist available. I wish I wasn't, but... Here I am. Besides, they needed someone who had some experience with the Reach. Of course, I never expected to end up in the middle of a siege. Well, tell me more about the Briarhearts. I've encountered Reach magic before. I'm almost certain that these Briarhearts are grown in some fashion. Not unlike apples or grapes or juniper berries. That's strange. But what are the Briarhearts? From what I've been able to observe, when a winterborn warrior falls, 
The prior hearts are used to somehow bring them back from the dead. I'm pretty sure the Hag Ravens are involved in the process. And you can put an end to the process? <coughs> if I'm right, and the Briar Hearts are grown, then I can destroy them. I'll know for certain once we get inside and look around. I want to make sure I mix the elixir correctly. Wouldn't want to inadvertently make them stronger, you understand? No, I agree. Alright, well I guess I got the King and the Alchemist and Bastion with me. I got a threefer. Hello. You temporarily sit down while I take care of your buddy. Nice try. Kamehameha! God, I love that ability. Done, so. Good. You found him. How? Alright, howdy, Emily. Nice to see. Is she gonna come with us too? Ready when you are. Nope. Come, come, follow me. If my suspicions are correct, we shouldn't have any trouble finding what I'm looking for. We're all going to die down here, aren't we? Nope. Keep your eyes open. I'm looking for a plant or a root. Something that doesn't appear quite to die. Let's go. You're screwed, buddy. Just a minute. Something like this. Oh, I almost continued going on. Now I would have ruined that. Talk to me. Now there's something you don't see every day. A tree growing out of a corpse. I'd say this is what we're looking for. This sapling is but a root, however. A small part of a greater whole. So the hearts grow on these tiny trees. Reach magic corrupts nature. It uses its innate properties to forge terrible powers. The briar hearts require a larger plant to nurture them and make them grow. But this vile sapling is certainly connected. I can feel energy flowing through it. So what does that mean exactly? We need to destroy some of these saplings. Cut off their power to weaken the central tree. Once weakened, I can apply an alchemical solution to the central tree, wherever it grows, and hopefully destroy it, roots and all. Uh, why don't we just find and destroy the central tree? Reach magic invades nature, the way a plague violates an infirm body. It changes its host, taking hold and letting its corruption grow stronger. It creates defenses, barriers that can't be easily overcome. It needs to be weakened before we lay siege. So what do you want me to do? Find the saplings and burn as many as you can. That will weaken the corruption and make the defenses more fragile. Meanwhile, I'll concoct a potion using clippings from these little ones. Leave the elf here if you would. I could use the protection. Yeah, no worries. Emily will stay behind and keep you safe. Leave the sapling I found alone. I'll use it to prepare and test my elixir while you burn as many of the others as you can. By the time you return, I'll have developed a poison powerful enough to eat through the central tree's weakened defenses. You want this? Uh, you've dealt with this kind of reach magic before? No, not exactly. In some ways it's the same, but in many others it's completely different. The last time I dealt with reach magic, they were utilizing vines as big as you or I. This is an entirely new type of twisted magic, even for them. How confident are you that this will work anyways? I'm completely confident of my abilities. That's just my nature. At its core, reach magic is all the same. They just employ different vessels for their perversions. Once you know how to kill one vile and twisted plant, you can kill them all. Good to know. Thank you. Emily, protect him with your life. We need him. So they're everywhere, it looks like. Taste our steel! <laughs> One down. How many more to go? Four, three more to go. Or maybe it's just the fire. Got him. Dunzo. Can't rely on magic. Change your strategy. What are you doing? 
He wouldn't attack for some reason. You're not, well, I was gonna say, you're not gonna get me, but kinda sorta did. Kinda sort of. So that's two down. So now we're going this direction? Yes. Sit Joe Fuck down. I love watching that. Yet another one? Oh god. Sit down. Bastion, take care of my lightweight, please. There you go. Good job, Bastion. Absolute monster of a human being you are. Oh, hello. Even though it just you think you are clever and burn you tiny saplings. But they are mere children compared to our beloved tree. Your actions do not surprise me. Orcs and allies all believe they are stronger than the Reach. Foolish even to the end. Why are you locked up anyways? I am preparing myself. Going through the ritual period of solitude before they place the Briarheart in my body. Once I take my place as a Briarheart warrior, I will kill you and rain death down upon the orcs who befoul our land. You're kind of uh, angry, aren't you? Angry? I am burning with a righteous rage. Once I have joined the ranks of the Briarheart warriors, that anger will fuel my vengeance and bring justice to my people. What have the or uh, orcs done to deserve your vengeance? What haven't the orcs done? They claim land that rightfully belongs to the Reach. They attack and kill my people. They eat food that should be eaten by Winterborn. They are animals. Not even the help of outsiders will save them from my wrath. What do these Briarhards do? Magic you will never understand. To receive a Briarheart is a precious gift. To receive one while I'm still alive, that is a singular honor. The Hag Ravens give us these gifts, even as they care for the tree upon which the sacred fruit grows. What are you talking about? What a terrible enemy you are. <laughs> you don't even know about the source of your own doom. Nope. I would feel sorry for you, but instead I just want to kill you even faster. It sounds like you don't know anything about the tree either. Of course I know about the tree. It gives the sacred fruit life. It is strong, powerful, eternal. It cannot be destroyed. It hates you. Because you burn its babies. I will kill you for doing that too. Once I get my briar heart. Because he's not man enough to do it on his own. He has to get some sort of a spell to even attempt it. There won't be any more hearts once we destroy this tree. You think you can destroy our eternal tree with fire and axes? Bah! Your tools are useless! Tree's roots run strong and deep. But please, feel free to give it a try. The Hag Ravens will eat your eyes and use your body for fertilizer. Good to know, thank you. Hey! Look at that teleportation Good. status, dude. Remember how you did that. We're disgusting. That's all of them, right? Okay, so we came through here. Then we made a right, or technically a left. Then a left here. Oh, hello. Get your weapon out. Oh, there's another one. Can you say... Good night. Hi, Evelyn. Where did you go? So, I don't suppose you maybe might have seen Alanon on your way back? Maybe? <sighs> she 
she let him go. Or she... Not intentionally, of course. What happened to Alanon? Listen, it wasn't my fault. Uh-huh. Alanon sent me to get him some moss that grows on the walls down here. When I got back, the alchemist was gone. We have to find him. Right. That's an excellent plan. But you should take this. Alanon said it was the last ingredient he needed to finish his elixir. I don't see his alchemy bag, so he must have the rest of the components with him. If the tree hasn't eaten them yet. The tree ate Alanon? What? No, of course not. At least, I don't think it ate him. But he told me that the Winterborn plant Briarheart seeds in dead bodies. The seed eats the body, sprouts roots, and nourishes the tree. Or something like that. I wasn't <laughs> really listening. Of course you weren't, Emily. <laughs> You're terrible at paying attention. Good archer, though. You have no idea where we should look. go look for him? Well, I went that way to gather the moss, so he must have gone the other way. Probably turn right at the bend ahead. Let's split up. We can cover more ground that way. Besides, I kind of feel it's my fault since I left him alone and all that. Okay, goodbye. Oh, Evely, I love you and I hate you both at the same exact time. I am not afraid of you. Don't blame the elf. She was just following orders. Tell you the truth, I need more soldiers like her in my army. Good to know, King. Done so. Courage brings victory. Whatever you say. Is there? Need Bastion well alone. Need Bastion to go alone times two. You really needed to use your ultimate for just one random trash mob, Bastion? You make me sick, you know that? You're not gonna hit me, buddy. Got him. Dude, I love this game so much, man. So freaking much. Oh, hi. Whoa, what happened there? You saw the dagger? It was a little weird. Doesn't surprise me though, this game is a little wonky sometimes. By sometimes, I literally mean all the time. Who's talking? I'm literally stuck. There we go. Sit your butt down. I really want to know who was talking. What oh, wrong button? That's it. Are you hurt? No. But well, thank you, Bastion. Is it this way? Yeah, it is. We've got to be close. You're not doing nothing. Sorry. Can you say dead? No, because you don't exist anymore. You've got no power left. Use a potion. I know this, Bastion. Do I have some of that crown tristat? I'll take this for now, I guess. Got him. Wait, hold on. Can I even go that way? You know what? I'm willing to bet it's in that one room that we passed by. That we didn't actually look in. Right in here. I'm almost certain of it. It won't hurt to go back and try anyways. These guys aren't very tough. Oh, that scared the crap out of me, dude. Not gonna lie. To 
about oh, there time is. you got here, do something before I roast up here. Don't just stand there and watch me roast. Do something. What are you doing up there? What am I doing? I'm being roasted alive. What does it look like I'm doing? What's worse, they have my alchemy bag. The elixir was nearly complete when I stumbled into that Winterborn patrol. Let me see if I can figure out how to lower the cage. No, no. We're running out of time and you have a more important task to complete. You have to destroy the central tree. Otherwise, the Briarheart warriors will eventually overrun the orcs. I'll... I'll find a way out of here... somehow. Yeah, I don't think you will. What do you want me to do? Find the Hag Raven that snatched my alchemy bag and grab the elixir. I couldn't wait for Eberle, so I found the moss on my own. Of course, that's when I ran into the Winterborn. Anyway, get the elixir and destroy that tree. Finish this for will me. Do. There you are. I was looking all over for... Hey, how'd Alanon get up there? He flew. He doesn't look very safe. We should get him out of there before he cooks, right? I'll leave that to you. I'm not 100% certain, but I bet I could break the chain holding up the cage with a few well-placed arrows. You help, Alanon. I need to find this elixir. Sure, sure. Don't worry. I've got this. You don't suppose the cage will shatter on impact, do you? Just make sure he doesn't get hurt. No worries. I never hit anything I'm not aiming at. Well, except for that one time. But that totally doesn't count. I told Bonfor not to move. Go on. I'll take good care of the alchemist. Good to know. Thank you, Emily. Hey, I need you to stay very, very still so I can get you down. With a bow and arrow? The cage will drop into the fire with me inside. Just make sure you tuck and roll. Okay, Evelyn, you're literally a maniac. Oops. Nice try. Destruction staff is literally coming up in the world. Dunzo. You want some too? That's it. Don't let them finish. Damn, it's only a hag raven. There's literally it's a lot going on right now. Is it this way? You know it is. Sit down. Yeah, I think I'm gonna end up getting a... A Restle staff just because it'll look better. It's not like I'm using any... Destruction staff uh, skills anyways. Oh, I didn't realize this dude was here. Got the alchemy bag. Uh... So I don't go back to him, I just go straight to the tree? Oh, this is the tree! Pour it on the tree! The Winterborn are on their way! Okay, I'm trying. Defend the tree until the elixir does its work. Just don't let the Winterborn get close enough to heal it! How would they no! heal it? Stop the intruders! The tree must not be destroyed! <laughs> Oh, he's already dead. I don't know why I was trying to hit him. Come and take us. Sit your butt down. Is that it? That's all you got? You guys are absolutely trash. Get out of my way. Except until I run out of resources. Let me guess. Huzzah! Joe, butt down. I love making them sit. You want some? Got 
Got him. Oh no. You broke the spell. Good. Oh wait, that's not good. Is it good? Roll. Oh my god, this is so annoying. Go! I got no stamina. Bastion, I need you to do a better job at protecting this. It's clearly, I'm um, not where it's at. Hey, stamina. We've got to be getting close. Oh, come on, that didn't even do anything. One more problem Completed. Solved. Now, let's go take care of Ice Heart. Oh, we're going to fight Ice Heart right now. Ooh, I'm excited. It's going down. Ice Heart and the supplies are still in there. We can't leave yet. Don't worry, I got Ice Heart. He is donezo. Or, or not. Is this it? Wait a minute. Oh, he's right here. I just need to catch my breath. I'll be fine. He tried to roast you. That's not how we define fine where I come from. No? Compared to some of my adventures, this was practically a day at the fair. Okay. Not the fair I want to go to. You've got me out of that cage with a damn fine strike. Damn fine. And you, you handled the Briarheart tree perfectly. Well done. Did the elixir work? Is the source of the Briarhearts destroyed? Indubitably. Indubitably. I the roots burn with my own eyes. The siege commander needs to hear about this. So we can press the advantage and put an end to the Winterborn threat. As for me, I'm going to relax. Somewhere in Orsinium with a very large drink. You deserve it, man. And of course. Let's go ahead and just destroy some stuff. Don't need that. Okay, that's good enough. What did I get anyways? Soldier, return to the siege commander. And let's finish off these winterborn bastards. Good to know. Oh, we have to go back inside? Yeah, I gotta go back inside, apparently. Alright, let's go. 